Oh, hi, Anna. Oh, hi, Emily. Hi, it's so nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. And you're coming in from, are you in Stanford, Connecticut? Yes. Oh, I love Stanford. I have friends there that live there. They absolutely love it. Visit them. My family's from Westchester, so I've been Oh, out wow. to Stanford a bunch. Yeah, it's a beautiful area with the water. And where, where are you located? So we recently moved to Pittsburgh. So that's where the new Road Curls headquarters is as well. Um, so Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Oh, nice, nice, lovely. It is nice. It is nice. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to help you today, Anna, with your curling headband. You're good to go. You got it. <laughs> I got mine here too. So the way it works is uh, well, it's very casual, but we'll talk through um, if you've used it before, how it's turned out, anything in particular you want my help with. We'll go through prepping your hair and all that as well. And then we'll practice wrapping the hair together to make sure it feels comfortable and secure. And then it's getting the curls you're looking for. But yeah, any anything at all I'm here to help with, basically. But um, yeah, so have you used it in the past or have I you? tried. I, I I got last week. I tried and it came up great. And um, I uh, <laughs> my hair is very straight. Yeah. So it's it was hold it whole day. Even next day, it still was kind of like a little bit wavy. So um, I, I I love it. I love it. And it was not bad, not too bad to sleep. So. Awesome. I'm so happy to hear that. I have the same hair type as you. Like curling irons, my hair goes flat so quickly. But when you do these wet and set curls, not only is it healthier, but it actually lasts. And I think that's the coolest part. Awesome. When you did it, did you use water? How did you prep your hair beforehand? I, I did exactly how it was in the video. Awesome. Okay. I, I have uh, my teenager daughter. She she has already like all uh, tools. But she has, I think, a cheap version, and I want to get her like this one. I think it's better. I tried because that one is that she has. I mean, I have a bunch of them. It's like very puffy one, and I think it's not the same. Yeah, uh, the puffy ones will like roll off your head, and um, they all like we've developed our own materials inside of it to help with the absorption of the water without over drying your hair, and that's why your curls are lasting so long too. Um, I'm so happy to hear that. That's the coolest thing, Anna. <laughs> I love it. And um, my husband loved curls. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> Making everyone happy. Cool. Um, I, I actually like how it looks when you pull up on the back. It looks cool. But he was like, what the heck? Like, what's going on? <laughs> he said, what is that? I said, no, I'm doing curls. Like, okay. It's better than rollers, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, my God, yes. Oh, forget those. Cool. Um, awesome. So I think the way you prepped your hair, if you followed my instructions, that's perfect. You know, dry hair, super lightly dampen it, ear level down like we normally do. Um, and if you ever need more hold, like in the summertime, if it gets super humid, um, add a little bit of mousse into a spray bottle with the water, shake it up and lightly spray your hair. But mm -hmm. it, right now it's not humid where you are. So I wouldn't worry too much about the mousse. And um, I didn't use a um, holder. Like I didn't spray it after, but uh, I think maybe like for event, right? Like it's better to spray. For events, the way to get your hair to last the longest, add a little bit of <clears throat> mousse beforehand. Um, hairspray afterwards, the hairspray that I love and recommend, I'm not affiliated or paid by them in any way. I think I have it here. Um, I don't have it here. It's called Got To Be Freeze. And you um, can find it. Emily, I, do you mind type it? For, yeah, for me? I can type it. I'll put it in the chat. Let me see. Got To Be Freeze Hairspray. I'll see if I can find the link really quick. Got to be, okay. Got to be. I'm going right now on Amazon. Freeze spray, yeah. Blasting freeze spray. They'll have it on Amazon too. Basically, you don't want to put a lot on and keep it <clears throat> kind of far from your face while you're doing it. But this is the hairspray that they use to make mohawks. 
Oh my so God. If you like lay your hair flat and you spray it and let it dry, like really close, really? You know, it is so strong. It's the best hairspray because otherwise a lot of hairsprays, they don't do much for me. So that one, just hold it a little bit. Oh. And it'll help. Yeah, it's an awesome one. So recommend it's interesting. Um, it's probably will be great for my daughter because my daughter she has curly hair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's awesome. I mean, not not African American, but like like curly, like baby. Yeah. That's so awesome. for her, it's like staying like two three days. Oh yeah, her hair will set so quickly, so quickly, and it'll last so long because her hair is already trying to form that curl shape. You and I, we have to work harder at it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I, I was wondering. Um, so when I like, I have a question regarding like techniques. When I was um rolling, I was doing like very tight first first time yeah. because I wasn't sure how, because my daughter said, "Oh, mom, your hair won't hold it because you have such a straight hair." So I was like tight it's very tight but I like more like natural like beach waves yeah so, sure. so I need to do like more loose like not more loose, loose. yeah we can do that together um why don't we do that we'll wrap through it together and we'll set it so it's a little more loose um before we begin when we part our hair since you and I we both have a side part I usually recommend <laughs> exactly the same <laughs> same side part looks good um <laughs> When we when we part our hair for um, bringing it to the front, I usually recommend keeping the side, then cutting it to the middle so that you have a little bit more hair. Oh. Otherwise, you'll have less hair on one side, more hair on the other. So the mm -hmm. one with less hair will turn out a little bit tighter. It just helps the curls turn out a little bit more the same. Mm -hmm. Awesome. <laughs> um, cool. And then if you have a spray bottle, damp in the hair. You don't have to do it right now but ear level down, super lightly damp. And then scrunchies on the wrist. I put them here so when we get to that part, we have them ready to go. Oh, mm -hmm. And then I like to fold it in half so that the ends are even and you get that crease in the middle. And the wire, you'll see it's all on one side. So when we put it on, we want the wire facing forward. Perfect. Now, were you able to do this step where we make the pigtail? You got it? I, I, I was I was like I can help. <laughs> so many times. Okay. Are you a righty or a lefty? I am a righty. Okay, uh, left hand on top. Left hand. And then with your right hand, instead of going like this, go like this. Yep, mm -hmm. that'll make it easier. And grab the hair on that side, pull it towards your face and then over the headband. <laughs> and I can make it easier too. Perfect. And now you just want to get the end of the headband kind of popped up a little bit. Doesn't uh -huh. matter. Perfect. Now you're in a good spot. All you have to do is grab the hair and with your fingers, push the headband. Yep. And wrap it around the end a couple of times. So it's just, you nailed it. Great job, Anna. Oh, you're so cute. I love the color of your sweatshirt. <laughs> <It's so pretty. laughs> Thank you. Okay, cool. So now we can work on the other side. We'll grab a front section. Mm -hmm. That's a good section, perfect. And pull it over and under. And instead of making it tight, just mm -hmm. have it over under, don't pull it too tight. Uh -huh. Perfect. And then we'll add another section right underneath the first and combine it, great. And pull it over and under, fabulous. And now maybe one more small section right underneath. We'll do three of these combined. And again, don't pull it too tight. Just go over and under. Larger sections will help to create like looser waves as well. So I do three here and now you're at the ear. So combine all the hair together. Whoa, okay. Yep. And that'll help the curls start sooner in the back too. And now while you're wrapping it around, pull the headband kind of close to your jawline. So don't hold it out here, but hold it in here. If, so instead of holding the headband out here, just kind of hold uh -huh. the headband in and wrap uh -huh. it around. Uh -huh. Beautiful. And then just keep wrapping till you get to the end of the hair and it's all wrapped up. One other tip is it's helpful to make sure each hair wrap is touching the last. 
So you don't oh, see the headband oh, and that'll okay, help yeah, make sure yeah. the shape is consistent. Mm -hmm. Perfect. I'm just I don't even look what I'm doing. I'm looking at you. Like <laughs> <laughs> You're doing a great job. I'm really impressed then. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Okay. So we're at the end. So now we can grab our scrunchie. Perfect. Mm -hmm. And throw it around. Wrap it maybe once, twice, maybe three times. You don't want it to like be too tight on the end. Mm -hmm. But then it'll just like squeeze it too tight, make the curls tight. Perfect. Nailed it. Awesome, Anna. And now we can do a little twist, just a little twist to tighten it. Uh, Perfect. Uh, just like uh, excellent. So this is where you get more control as well. So if you really want tight curls, twist it a whole bunch. You want a little bit looser, loosen it up a little bit. Bingo. So you have okay. great play with that. Cool. And now we just repeat on the other side. So untwist it. Cool. Fabulous. All right. So we'll grab our front uh, section of hair again. How do the colors look though? Great. I remember you told in the tutorial, don't grab too much at the yeah, top. Exactly. And I, I watched say, your video like five times. Oh, <laughs> I'm glad it's helpful. I really am. It, it is. Fabulous. It took, uh, I figured it's long, but it, it, if people follow it, it'll work. <laughs> it well, gets, I need, I need to watch like, hundred times to understand, <laughs> but now I, I kind of like. Yeah, I mean, you're doing such a good job. So I have, I have no comments. Your sections are not too far back. You're doing great. Yeah. You um, and then you add another section. Yep, combine them. And again, each wrap touching the last. You're doing so good, Anna, with no video, no mirror either. I'm very impressed. Yeah. And we'll do another section underneath and combine. Ooh, yeah, Fabulous. Beautiful. Yeah. And now we can grab all the hair because we're at the ear. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One moment. I have to get, get chopped with you. No, I'll mm -hmm. wait for you. I'm sorry. I went too far. Uh, okay. All the hair. Right. And kind of pull the headband a little bit close to the jawline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because otherwise mm -hmm. what'll happen, you'll wrap it out here. And then when you go in, you get this like poof. So when you pull it in close, it helps. Um, so for here grab all the hair, pull the headband into the jawline, and then wrap. Yeah, beautiful, nailed it. Perfect, Anna. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> I think it looks great on you. You look adorable. Oh, it's like French you. braid pigtails. It's so French cute. Braid. Yeah, I like it. It's like 19th century style. Yeah. Like, I love it. I Very like romantic. It. Very romantic, very demure. It's beautiful. Yeah. Perfect. And then a couple wraps. It's like, I, I don't know, for me, it's like, looks like a German style, you know? Yes, yes, completely. I picture like the Swedish girls, the German girls. Yeah. It was here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly it. So then you can twist it if you want or twist it the other way just to make it a little bit. Yeah, there you go. A little bit tighter because we didn't do it too tight when we were wrapping it. So perfect. Beautiful, Anna. And then do the headband look if you like. You just cross them in the back. I switch hands. The one that's under, I tuck it around and over. The one that's over, I tuck it around and under and just, you know, smush it down. There's no wrong way to do it. Let's see. I, I can't oh, see. Oh, you nailed it, Anna. Perfect. Beauty. <laughs> And I see you have a little crease. You can just smush the crease down on the top. Perfect, beautiful. Perfect, honey, you did such a good job. Awesome. And then you always just wanna make sure your hair is 100% dry before taking it out. If you're wearing it overnight, no problem. Otherwise, you know, two hours or so would probably dry your hair. Wow, wow, that's exciting. Thank you so much, Emily. My pleasure, Anna. Do you have any other questions for me? No, I, who's this girl who is, uh, you have like a book or what is oh. that? Uh, you talking about this one here? Yeah. Uh-huh. This is Alex Gabori. Um, she's part of our team as well. She's a YouTuber. On, uh, I saw her. I saw her. She's fabulous. So she, when we first launched, we gave her our product. 
Um, I thought she was fabulous at explaining how to do things. And so we she made her is. like the face of the brand and she is just incredible with hair, incredible at creating the content and helping people learn how to do their hair and a huge fan of everything heatless. When she grew up, like she was doing rag curls and her mom would always set her hair in like different types of heatless styles. So she's now going to be more part of the team as well. Um, we've been working, we've known her for several years, um, but we're bringing her in more and more. And she's amazing. Just the most amazing, wonderful person. We're so happy to have her as I part think, of the founding team. I think I found her first, um, not for curls, but for Abdus. And I like her style, how she explained it was easy. And she has a nice face also, you know, like oh, nice to gorgeous. watch her. And uh, you have imagination. Oh, I will look like exactly the same. <laughs> and, and then she she showed this one. And I, I wasn't interested until I show how she showed. And I'm like, oh, okay, I will try it. Yeah, she is so good. And she is such a, her community is so um, important to her. And she does so good by them. Like everything she puts out there, she, she recommends and she stands by and she's just, I love her to pieces. She's the nicest girl. And she's very funny, too, in person. <laughs> Hilarious. A sweetheart. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Emily. I really appreciate it. And it was, uh, I, I was impressed to connect with you. I think you, you have amazing customer service. Thank you um, so much. As I I, I'm, you. I'm doing real estate with, um, you know, with like residential, commercial, and um we we had a lot of entrepreneurs um who showed their best of the best but i think you you're doing amazing i oh, just thank like, you so much um, i am you know, so grateful for our other... team and everything i couldn't do it alone that's for sure and we all like the whole reason we do what we do is because of the customers we love to bring to life new inventions like that's that's our basis of it but being able to connect with the customers and help them learn how to use it like that that's the joy in all of it Oh, well, this is genius. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Emily. I, I don't want to keep you too long. I appreciate it. Um, I appreciate you, Anna. Thank you so much for being our curl friend, hon. It was so wonderful to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. And I hope your daughter enjoys it, too. <laughs> I I will tell her and maybe she will join uh, on yeah. Zoom. Yeah. So you can show her some tricks. I would love to meet her. <laughs> All right, and have a wonderful weekend. Thank you. You too. Bye, honey. Bye.